Hi. How have you been? How I'm, are you? And my life is going smoothly. And how are you doing? I'm doing great. As usual, it is going well. Okay, so, very nice. So, could you please introduce yourself to my viewers? Because I know you, but my viewers want to know you. Yes. So, myself, Sonal, and I'm from Delhi. And now I have been pursuing graduation last year. And with this, I'm teaching as well students, and I teach English. And with this, I have started my own YouTube channel. because i want to share my knowledge and experience there as well so that's wow. what and what is your channel name please my channel's name is learning with sonal because yeah because uh, with this uploading process i would be learning something there that's why i oh. have put very nice very nice and my viewers will definitely show their love to your channel that will be great Yeah. And so, uh, how did you learn English? What is your way to learn English? My way, uh, it has been similar because yes, the process of learning this language is quite similar for everyone. Because means what are the process? There are four things. First is reading, writing, speaking, and what uh, listening. Yes. so these are the these are four ways where we have to work on and if we are working equally on every uh, every steps on every thing then we will grow and most important thing is speaking because yes this is a language and we here we have to speak because agar hum hindi seekhte hain na to usse hame bolna hota hai so similarly we have to speak english that's what we have to yeah because there are so many people there are so many people who uh, who have a lot of knowledge about uh, uh, the grammar and all the things but they are not able to speak so yeah. this is Ooh, this is the biggest problem and speaking is the most important part yeah of learning english you can say mm-hmm. and so yeah you have to practice whatever you know you yes. have to practice otherwise you can uh, forget Mm-hmm. so one thing i would mention here that uh, i was a hindi medium student I mean so till 8th or 9th standard i was in hindi medium then i had thought of uh, shifting my medium from hindi to english and okay. then how i started yeah in 9th standard i started to put my attention towards this language and uh, in 11th or 12th i gained this more uh, I I became so uh, means uh, inclined towards this language. So this is why th- then how I have been working on it, and teachers have helped me, mentor has helped me to learn this, and yes, I would appreciate myself as well because I have been working on this. Means I have been working on my pronunciations, on vocabulary, and the same I do means with the same purpose of improvement. I have uh, started to share as well. Yeah, definitely. Good. That's great. That's really nice. And yes, uh, when I want to say something about you, that means uh, recently, lately, I had watched your video on YouTube. Yes, in the starting, I had watched your video on Instagram first. Instagram, mm-hmm. it's real. Means it's a uh, not on a uh, not any detailed video. But when I watched your YouTube video, then really. there is something that must be appreciated that must be appreciated because you know what what you are doing you are providing opportunities to people because what i realized that we learn english we speak english we read write we do everything but what happens we do not get people we do not get partner with whom we can practice and you are doing that so i was so happy i was so delighted that you are making effort you are means you are doing something which is needed which is actually needed because people want to speak people want some people with whom they can practice but they don't get but yeah. you are doing that so really this is appreciable i am flattered sonal and some viewers asked me in the comment section that they are very kind of that they are very terrified if they are judged if they are being judged by the people to overcome such 
kind of things because initially we we think that uh, we will be judged by the people we will be laughed at by the people so how to handle this kind of things what do you know how did you how you handled such kind of thing yes yes it happens it happens with everyone when because english is not our language when we learn this language we feel so uncomfortable we do not feel so comfortable that we uh, we can speak in front of other people it happens it was the same case with me as well that i i used to think that i wouldn't speak till the time i'm going to perfect means uh, till the time i would have great command on fluency on pronunciation then only i will speak this happens with everyone but i would suggest them that no you should start you should start today by um, in, at at whatever level you are you should start this because when you take actions when you make actions then you improve so we have to we, uh, we should not think about other people and if uh, about any mistake as well because yes this is not this All is language. A, yes yeah, this skill we are learning a different language and if we are learning something else so there we have to give some time and after time we will improve surely so we should not feel uh, that we are going to be judged well it happens this is hu- human behavior that we feel that we are going to be judged so we have to overcome this yeah by timing by pra- by practicing yeah you can good good Uh, could i ask some questions from you yeah sure since a uh, general question is that when did you start learning this language or was uh, was this something that you had been learning from the starting so when have you started this yeah actually i love learning english since my childhood but and also i was good enough in writing in reading english but i was unable to speak english well because as you know that english is not our native language so that difficulty i was facing in my childhood in a large scale so and also sometimes i used to get stuck while speaking in english in front of people so that's why i want to always i always wanted to speak english fluently so and i realized that that thing is very important to get a job to crack an, to crack an interview and everything english is is the most That's common language widely spoken the, language absolutely and also you will be preferred first if you know english besides your skill so mm-hmm. i and i am very curious to learn this language and i am very passionate about learning english so that's that's how i started my learning english journey this language has been included in the list of a skill okay. yes so that's why we must learn this uh, this language and yeah so w- there is one more thing that that is making me excited that is that you are from west bengal and i am from delhi and we have been having this conversation and w- w- i have seen your many videos where you have been having conversation with kambli teachers or someone like that so how did you get that approach yeah it actually i can say that it takes a lot of guts to upload your videos your initial videos that you stuck, you used to get stuck a lot of time but you if you have that passion to learn something new and if you have passion to share your knowledge then you can definitely go whatever you want you want to do so that started that it is needed it is very much needed and i started this that for my improvement as well as if someone is facing same problem like me then he or she yeah. learn yeah. language like me with the help of me so that's why i started and that's why i uploaded videos and i want to continue my youtube journey Mm-hmm. so yes this is what i have observed that in every video you uh, share general topics which is related to a real life means anyone can learn from that thing if if any viewer is watching that video he will uh, get to know uh, how to how to frame simple sentences how to talk in a simple way about their passion their interest what they like in uh, food or their hobby i have seen i have observed that you ask these general questions so that people can understand or they can learn how to speak yeah. so uh, 
and yes yeah, sonal uh, what will you do after this conversation what will i do well uh, i have taken my dinner i am so quick <laughs> i am so means i am uh, i follow my schedule i am very good in following my schedule and i feel very happy i feel delighted when i follow my schedule and if i don't then i feel stressed <laughs> yes i do not feel good but if i have done everything then i feel okay yeah. now i do, i do not have anything else to do so i have taken dinner i have taken classes means i have provided classes so to now to online uh online yeah it was online how many students you are teaching like it was one, it was one on one oh one on one conversation one on one class oh, yeah. wow nice very nice and what subjects do you teach like english or general studies uh, basically english but uh, or i i teach kids as well and there there is purpose to behind that and the purpose is that if you teach kids you will be happy you will be all the time smiling or uh, feeling so delighted from inside because they will make you happy so that is my purpose to teach them as well so in day, in day time i teach kids i teach uh, till 8th class students and i and uh, i provide english classes to 11th 12th and 9th or literature oh that's really great yeah. and you are so jolly person i can say you are so very you are so jolly yeah you can say <laughs> good very good you should be and so i wasn't i wasn't i believed i wasn't but now i am <laughs> because yes a we change we people do change with time yeah by time yeah. so that's true and so have you visited to west bengal before i want i want to visit i haven't <laughs> and even i have not visited delhi hmm. and i am native of bihar so it is very close to bihar yeah. neighbor state so i haven't but i will <laughs> and and so you are born and brought up delhi yes. or bihar yes i have been uh, i have been means Yes, yeah, it can be. I have, I, I haven't born here, but I have been brought up here. <laughs> can say. 